Third Palestinian dies after Israeli soldiers shot 131 people during protests along the Gaza border. A third Palestinian has died after he was shot by Israeli troops as thousands protested along the Gaza border on Friday. Ahmed Abu Lulu was shot in a section of the border east of the southern city of Rafa and died of his wounds in hospital on Saturday morning. The 40-year-old was among 131 Palestinians wounded by Israeli bullets during the protest, breaking an unofficial ceasefire after less than 24 hours. Two others died in the border clashes, Ali Al Alal, 55, and volunteer medic Abdullah al qatadi 21, Gaza's health ministry confirmed. A Palestinian was in critical condition after being shot in the head, but it was not clear if this was Mr. Lulu or a fourth protester. A few thousand protesters gathered in different locations along the border, setting tires ablaze and throwing stones. The Israeli army said a grenade was thrown at troops guarding the border with northern Gaza without causing any casualties. It said troops responded with tank fire against two Hamas posts, despite the ceasefire between Israel and Hamas, which controls Gaza. The European Union called for an urgent de-escalation and warned the two sides are dangerously close to a full-blown conflict just four years on from their last war. Extensive airstrikes were launched at Gaza on Thursday in retaliation for more than 180 rockets and mortar rounds fired by Hamas and its allies on Wednesday night. But an unofficial ceasefire agreement between the two foes went into effect around midnight. This evening a few thousand Palestinians gathered along the border for weekly protests. Mr. Qatadi was in his 20s and a volunteer with the Hamas Medical Services. A health ministry spokesman says he was shot in the chest in southern Gaza. He would be at least the second medic to have been killed by Israeli fire during months of border protests. Today's demonstration was smaller than those of previous weeks. The Israeli army said a few thousand rioters gathered in a number of sites along the border, with soldiers using live fire and other riot dispersal tactics. Three Palestinians were killed in the Israeli strikes, while seven Israelis were wounded by Palestinian rocket fire. It was one of the most serious flare-ups since the 2014 Gaza war and followed months of escalating tensions.